Should I go down the slide? Yes. Oh, that was like way slower. <laughs> Wee! How slow. What are we doing today? I'm um, going on the boat. What um, boat? A steamer boat. Where? On the way. Where's the boat at? Uh, waiting. Oh yeah? Yeah. Say, like, come with us. Come with us! Come on! Oh, Judah's already taken off. There you go. Thanks, sir. What is your name, sir? I'm Brandon. All right. On, this is my wife Erin and this is Elijah that's coming on right now. Hey. This is Lacey. Hello. Hello. And then this is Brian. I never hey. And this oh is God. Aubrey. Hi Aubrey. Hi. Let me introduce our crew. This gentleman here is Tony Edmund, our chief engineer. Hi Tony. That's Deborah's husband. Hi Tony. <laughs> no. Hi Chief. Oh, chief. Hi, chief. chief. Say chief. Hi, chief. Yeah. <laughs> One day when you're in the military, you'll understand <laughs> once you're a chief in the military, that's all you get called from then on. Okay? Plus, if you talk real nice to him, he might let you come down and see his engine. Okay? So you gotta say yes, sir, or no, sir. Mike, you ready? Yes, sir. Tony? I want you to look at those plants right there. Those are tules. That's what this boat is named after. Those are tule reeds. Aztec Indians gave them that name. I'm gonna turn on some music for you. Yeah, Y'all enjoy you. the ride. We're gonna go up to Twin Buttes Dam. Okay. As far as we can go on the river, we're gonna circle. You'll see the spillway, and you'll possibly see the release gates where they let the water out of Twin Buttes and into Nashville. And then we're gonna turn around and then we'll head out on the main channel and we'll do a spin out there and then we'll go in. So I'm here with a Captain Mac. He is uh, he is the the brain behind this entire operation, uh, the Thule Princess. Uh, the family's in the back having a great time. But uh, I thought it'd be cool to come up and talk with him while he's steering the boat and ask him a few questions. Uh, so Mac, when did you get this thing started? We first found out this boat was for sale in 2013, and we started talking to the city of San Angelo about a possible business lease out here at the lake for a steamboat ride. And we uh, got the lease from the city in 2014, and then we started the business in 2015. So we spent about two years prepping. If you could say one thing to the general public about getting out here and experiencing this boat, uh, the Thule Princess, what would it be? She's a one of a kind. The Thule Princess is the last and only side wheel paddle steamboat that has an authentic American style walking beam engine on it that's still operating commercially anywhere in the world. So if you want a one-of-a-kind experience here in San Angelo, this boat's it. It's a real-life steam engine with a real-life steam whistle and a real-life crew. So we have a great time showing everybody the pretty things that are out here at Lake Nasworth. And you guys know we have a five-year-old and a two-year-old out here right now, so any age will love it. So any day that it ain't raining is a good day to go steamboating, is what I say. So I agree. come join us. So what do you think so far, Mom? This is super awesome. Yeah? I want them to let me down okay, in the engine you room. <laughs> no, you can't do that. That's only reserved for people with cameras. Oh. Well, you better hand me that camera then. <laughs> what do you think, Judah? 
What do you think so far? Yeah? What do you think, Aubrey? Oh, yeah. Oh, Elijah gave it a thumbs up to you. You get, what, do you think, what do you think, Elijah? Oh, yeah, we got a thumbs up from Elijah. <laughs> what do you think, Brian? Bye, bye, sure. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> Tell me what it was like getting the steer. Um, I, I looked like a captain. You looked like a captain? Was it fun? Was it hard? No? That's awesome. Mommy, did you see Judah got to be captain for a little bit? Captain Judah? That is the coolest. Way to go. And I got to be Leonardo DiCaprio at the front of the ship. <laughs> the front of the ship. <laughs> so your dreams came true? I feel like you're, that's, you're not excited I, about my opportunity. I just think it's an yeah, inaccurate portrayal of Leonardo DiCaprio. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Who let her on that boat? Who let her on the boat? What did you think about being captain for a little bit? How was it? Awesome. Awesome? I even got this. What is that? It's a thing to show to school. Oh, sweet. Because um, he knows somebody from school. Oh, perfect. His name's Mr. Captain. He's my music teacher. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's awesome. So would you do this again? Yes. Would you recommend this to all your friends? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm going to bring this on Wednesday. Oh, sweet. <laughs> So a real quick vlog for the Tully Princess. Um, if you're wondering a couple different things, kids are super cheap. I think kids are a dollar. Is that right, Brian? Kids are a buck. I think adults are $15. And uh, what's great is you have all this seating, all this area right here to hang out and chill, like Lacey behind me. And what's really cool about it is uh, you can actually bring you know, snacks if you want them, your drinks. Um, you can actually rent this for a private party. And if you rent it for a private party or some sort of event, um, it's BOIOB as, as well, just in case you were wondering. Um, you can, but it's a great time. It's really relaxing, really nice way to be outside. Above me, shade, um, and the kids are loving it. So yeah, this is an awesome option for something to do in San Angelo, Texas, for fun. What do you guys think? Dude, it's, it's 93 degrees out right now. And it doesn't feel like it. Doesn't it. Feel like it. Yeah. You know what I'm really digging right now? Uh, yeah. So much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Appreciate Hope it. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, we had a blast. Yes. There's a number. This is the number you need to call. Come check out this boat. Have a good time. Oh, we also right. have pedal boats. I know. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Picture real quick. You need the hydro bikes. The hydro bikes are awesome. Hydro bikes. Hydro bikes. Right. You tell me about. Riding on top of the water. Yes. Ryan, you see this? Yeah. Yeah, we are. Hydro bikes, Boy, they are so much fun. Looky there. there. Oh, yeah. You want to take it for a quick ride? Yeah. Sure. Okay. Step cool. forward. All right, awesome. Cool. Okay. No, don't now. do sharp turns because that becomes a break. Yeah. Sharp turns become a break. Yeah, right. Runners here. Runners you do on. this, kind of like, like, acts like oh, a yeah, break. Oh, yeah, break. Yeah, it's a shallow turn. Makes okay. wide turns. Okay, go. There we go. 
Oh, look at that mango. Oh, All yeah. these smokes. Is he filming? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cool. So is he. Hey, this is a no wake zone. <laughs> Throw your butt down. <laughs> Awesome. Man, a lot. Yeah, they're practicing. Two guys that built these. One was a hydro, uh, was a hydrodynamics guy, and uh -huh. the other was an aerodynamics guy. So they designed them, you know, to be no wind resistance, very little. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, it wasn't hard to do either. <laughs> that was like I, I, at some point I got with the wind and I was like, oh. all right, well, you guys have a good one. See you guys. Thank you. That's a wrap. We'll see you guys in the next one.